Come on, Patterson. Patterson. You're, you're preaching these people to hell, Patterson. How the choir is a portal to hell. Señor, a usted le quitaron la esposa. No deje que le quiten a su esposa, no deje que lo controle. No te estoy hablando a ti, no deje que te controle. Te quitaron a tu esposa. Ah. Make a stand. God 
God, he commands you to love her, not man. Dennis can save you, folks. Dennis can take you to heaven. Where's Dennis at? Dennis cannot take you to heaven, folks. What are we going to make a fair God? We love you. We're here because we love you. But most important, God loves you. That is giving you another chance to repent and come to him. Come on, Brother John. Come on, Adrian. When are you going to get out, Adrian? You have two beautiful wives, sir. 
all this about divorce and remarriage, that's not a God, sir. What about Christopher D? You guys sit there, Christopher D, Veronica Heisman. You guys sit there, they divorce their spouses. Their spouses wanted to dwell with them. And then it's married on You guys sit there and, and, and accept it. Come on. That's not of God.
Did you forget the time you were coming out? You were tired of the player and they moved you over here. Do you remember that time? You, you left and they got you back. Don't let them. You can be free. When you leave out the player, that's the best decision in your life that you have ever made. Because you're not going to be gay. You're only going to be gay. You want to be gay, but you're not going to do that. You know why? Because you love God, right? You love God, but the devil love you? Then it don't love you. God loves you. Then it can't make no miracles. All the times that you guys stand up and, and, and give uh, uh, accounts and, and, and give testimonies, huh? It's so he can record you, so he can hold that over your head. Don't let him hold anything over your head. Come on, Brother Stone. Brother Stone, you know we're telling the truth, sir. You can come out. You can come out and be free. God is waiting for you. God is waiting for you all the time. I want you out. You know this is of God. How to pray is of the devil. But I believe there's still sincere people there that seek it. Come on. Answer the call. Answer the call in me. You don't have to be bound. Then it binds you. He says liberating the oppressed. No, you guys are oppressed. Come on. Ma'am, don't let these people don't go in there. They separated me from my son. I haven't spoken to my son in seven years. They will see who is the strongest link in there, and they will separate you from your family, man. Don't allow them to. Be vigilant. Be vigilant. They will take your children away from you, just like they did me, just like they did my friend Diana, just like they did my friend Seth. Come on. Don't allow them. Don't let them lie to you, ma'am. Go to the website, hopcc.com. Brother, you know the truth, sir. Brother, you know the truth. Don't let them suck you back in, sir. You will give an account. God loves you. God loves you, Robert. Don't let them suck you back in, Robert. Come on, Sister the fear tag. Then it's just going to take a photo of that child. You will never see him. You will never see him again. Don't allow him to. You guys will give an account. Come on, Victoria. Victoria, are you going to give your children to the devil? You guys are sacrificing your children to save it. Don't do that. God loves you. God will provide for you. God will provide for you if you make a stand, Victoria. It's a fear tag. Come on. Ma'am, the 
will go in there, they will separate you from your family. This church is a cult. This church is a Jim Jones cult. Go to the website, hopcc.com. This church was raided by the FBI because they, they do fraud. Come on. VA fraud, insurance fraud, you name it, mortgage fraud. Come on, man. You can block it all you want, EJ, but the word of God will not return void. The word of God will not return void. You hear me, EJ. You know everything that's going on. You know you're tired. The control, the manipulation, the fake testimonies. Come on, praising Dennis. What about praising God? Where's God in all this? What about God? Didn't God save you? God saved you, not Dennis. Come on now. Come on, Sister Colleen. Sister Colleen, I feel so bad that you are your daughter to get here. Because this is a portal to hell. Your daughter is not happy. None of these marriages are happy. In fact, you know what Dennis said? That his whole purpose in House of Prayer was to destroy every marriage. We know that you have problems in your marriage, but you know why? Because you're allowing the man in your bedroom and in your marriage. You should only allow God. In the marriage, it's you, your husband, and God, not Dennis. Come on, Sister Colleen, God loves you. We love you. And your savings to the church. And now look at how they treat you, sir. They don't love you. They don't love you, sir. They left you in jail. Come on. They don't love you, sir. We love you. God loves you. Go in there and search God. God is not in the church. But you know what? You go home and you find that place, that final place to go. And you will answer. You will answer to you, brother Rambo. Come on, sir. God loves you, sir. Brother Delphonse, are you going to make a stand, Brother Delphonse? Brother Delphonse, your son is gone. Your son is gone, sir. God doesn't want you to go to hell, Brother Delphonse. God loves you. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. Man, sir, don't allow these people to destroy you. They will destroy your family, man. They destroy your family just like they did me. I have a son in there that I haven't spoken to in seven years. Man, they will, they will destroy you, completely destroy you. Get away from that place. This place is a portal to hell. This place is a portal to hell. Don't allow them to manipulate you and lie to you. Come on, Sister Delphine. Michael is doing amazing, amazing. When are you gonna get out of there, man? God is dealing with you. Come on, you sir, God loves you too. You know you're tired, you know you're tired of the control, the manipulation. Come on, sir. And go back to God. Dennis can save you. Dennis cannot save you. Dennis is not a God.
you provided for the Marcos, you provided for Bregui, you provided for Elin and Jody, you provided for Brother Escudero, you provided for all of us. Come on. Lanaya, don't let them destroy your baby, honey. Don't let them. We love you. God loves you. Come on, Sister Cooper. Come on, Zahaira. Huh? You say you left New Testament because of the corruption, but this is a thousand times worse. But God still loves you. Come on. You guys are going to give an account. You guys are wore out. You guys are tired. Working in that day school. Huh? Without getting paid. Come on. You can make it if you try. God loves you. God loves you. If you knew how hard God is fighting for you, you wouldn't be in this place. How to pray is a portal to hell. And you are all, honey. God loves you. Where is where you are, honey? Where is where you are? Come on. You can leave, Louis. See. Come on. How can you say you love God, but you hate me? Am I your enemy because I tell you the truth? Come on, Zay, you're wore out too, honey. You are wore out. You can make it without have to pray. And take your kid and your wife out of there. You guys can make it. You. Your daddy loves you so much. And at any time, you can call him. If you want to be out of here, he will come down here and get you, baby. You don't have to be here. That's not God. God's a 
people want to cut that? Where is that in the Bible? Come on, people, wake up. Where's Dennis? Where's the car leader, son? Where's the car leader? Live in up in a bus that is a school, right? But you guys are being here, uh, controlled, manipulated. Come on. What about the FBI raid? I mean, the FBI raid, I mean, that, that was enough for you guys to wake up. You think the FBI is gonna uh, spend uh, hundreds of millions of dollars when they raided five of the churches to find nothing? No, 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 they didn't stole the money. They didn't stole the money from the gentlemen, and they didn't steal the money right now. Come on, brother. Brother Smith. Brother Smith, you're not just not, brother Smith. a man or woman 
operated outside of NCCC that he or she would be damned to hell. This, however, is not true because no single organization can effectively evangelize the entire population of the, the earth in sufficient time. That is unreasonable. Change those letters from NCCC to IPCC. We have been living under a blanket of fear for years that if a man or woman operated outside of HOPCC, that he or she will be damned to hell. No, that is not true. This is not the so-called only church that's going to heaven. If anything, it's not, because Dennis is condemned to hell already, okay? Dennis blasphemed the Holy Ghost. So you know Dennis is not going to heaven, but you guys got a chance. You guys got a chance where everybody that, that God puts in your way, the Holy Ghost deals with you people. The Holy Ghost deals with you. I'm not here to condemn you, I'm here to love you. You know why? Because my own son was taken away from me. Don't allow Dennis to take your kids away from you. Don't allow Dennis in your bedroom. Don't allow Dennis in your marriage. Dennis is destroying you guys. Come on. You guys, a lot of you, you have no joy. You say you're a Christian, but where's the joy of the Lord in you? The Lord, the joy of the Lord should be in you all the time. Even when you guys see us out in the street, you guys should be able to say, you know what, Gladys? I'm praying for you. I love you. But you know what? You can't give what you don't have. If you don't have love, you can't give it. You know why? It's easy to love somebody that loves you back. It's easy. Come on, Brother Rand. For the world, you know the truth, sir. For the world, you know the truth. When are you going to get your wife out of there, Brother Rand? Brother Rand, I'm not coming over here with no fancy words, but the word of God. Come on, DJ. Then it said that if you left a uh, NPCC, that you were going to be damned to hell. That's the same thing that he's saying about hustle prayer. Hustle prayer is a thousand times worse. Are you, are you going to bypass what, what the FBI um, agents did here? Señores, no le dejen que le mienta, señores. No le dejen que le mienta. Solamente lo tienen aquí a ustedes para que le den el dinero a la iglesia. Aquí esta gente separa un familia. A mí me separaron de mi hijo. Hace siete años que yo no hablo con mi hijo. Y si esto fue, esto de verdad, fuera una iglesia de Dios, ellos no me separarían de mi hijo. No le den el gusto. Ellos les están mintiendo a ustedes. No los dejen que le mienten. No dejen que le mientan, señores. No dejen que le mientan. Yo te estoy diciendo la verdad. Mi hijo está ahí. Si tú quieres, puedes preguntar por él. Se llama Sigue. Ellos me lo quitaron. No me, de, no me dejaron ver. Solamente porque yo no vengo a esta iglesia. ¿Ah? ¿Qué iglesia se para familia? ¿Qué iglesia se para familia? ¿Sí? Díganme ustedes a mí. ¿Qué iglesia se para familia? Díganme. Díganme. ¿Tú me puedes decir en la Biblia donde dice que Dios se para familia? Búscamelo. Búscamelo en la Biblia donde dice que Dios se para familia. Come on, Brother Gibbs. I know you're tired and well, out, Brother Gibbs. You're wore out, sir. Dennis wears you guys out. Constant prayer meeting, soul winning, Bible study, this. He wears you out so much to where you, when you go home, you don't even have time to do anything but lay your head down and sleep. But you know what? The power of the Holy Ghost, the power of the Holy Ghost deals with you, sir. The power of the Holy Ghost deals with you and he tells you and he tells you time and time and time again come out from among them and be ye separate saith the Lord come out from among them come out from the corruption come out from the control come out from the manipulation come on people come out Jesus loves you Jesus is fighting so hard for you. Jesus is fighting so hard for you, sir. You with the Nike show over there, don't let them lie to you. I have a son there. His name is CJ. They separate family, sir. Oh, is that Jaden? That's you, Jaden? 
I mean, you could get out. You could get out, Dalen. You know the truth. Who's that, Chip's dad? Chip's son, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got high to my son, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Joshua. Your daddy loves you so much. God has blessed him mightily, honey. Mightily. Mightily. Come on. Dennis said when, uh, when we was in the uh, New Testament, he said there wasn't going to be all those divorces and remarriage. How can you sit there and allow Christy Boy B and Veronica Heitzman sit there, marry to, to somebody else that's not even their, their, their normal spouse, their first spouse? How do you sit there? How, how do you allow that? If anything, you need to condemn it, right? Because that's adultery. That is adultery. Everybody that divorces their spouse without no, no reason whatsoever, and you marry somebody else, that's adultery. That is straight up adultery. And God condemns that. Come on. You people know. You know the truth. How can you say you love God, but you don't love your brother? Huh? Ah. Ah, how do you love God, but you don't love me? What happened to reaching out to me? What happened if I'm so messed up? What happened? The love of God in your heart should like prick you and say, you know what? They're not the ones that are wrong. Let me reach out to them, you know? Let me tell them that I love them. But like I said, you can't give anything that you don't have. Look at what the Bible says, Romans 121. Because that, when they knew God, they glorified him not as God. Neither were thankful, but became vain in their imagination, and their foolish heart was darkened. Don't allow Dennis to darken your heart. Don't allow Dennis to darken your heart. If you leave House of Prayer, you are not going to be condemned to hell like Dennis says. Where's Dennis at? If he's so-called the last man on the earth that, that, that God has, where's he at? You guys haven't seen Dennis in the last couple of, what, four or five years? You only hear him through a polycom. Where is he? Where is he? Did Jesus hide? Did Jesus hide? Don't allow Dennis to make you um, Pharisees. Don't allow Dennis to make you Pharisees. Get the little thing right there. I think that's the end. Oh man, I don't see it. Come on, people, wake up. God loves you. God is reaching out any way he can. Hey, now, baby, you don't have to go to Dennis' house. You don't have to go to Dennis' house. He's a pervert. Where's Dennis? Where's Dennis at? Where's the pervert at? He fills you up with perversion, condemnation. Always condemn. You don't seem to, to, to get a step ahead. Always condemn, yelling at, oh, you did this, and you did that. Come on, people. Come on, my friend. The FBI didn't raid this church and four others for nothing. They didn't spend um, hundreds of millions of dollars for anything, so when an FBI do a raid, it's because they found enough evidence, sir. And if you don't make it right with God, you're going to go to jail, sir. You're going to go to jail, Mustang. But there's still time because God loves you, sir. You can repent. You can repent. You can turn dead and sin. God still loves you, sir. He can give you all the cars that you want, and all the houses that you want, and call it a blessing. Oh, you blessed me with a car. You blessed me with a house. No, honey, that's only to control you, to keep you, to keep you in debt. That's only to keep you in debt. But God loves you so much. So much God loves you. Come on, McCullough. He loves you. He has you as his personal gardener. For what, sir? 
You said that Dennis died for you. What? What in the world? I thought Jesus was the only one that died for us. The Bible doesn't mention Dennis died for us. Jesus died for us. Sir, woe unto you. Woe unto you, Pharisees and scribes, because you stay not a gnat, but swallow a camel. Come on, people. Woe unto you. Come on, Brother Bowser. Brother Bowser, we love you, sir. You're woe too, sir. But you don't have to stay here. You don't have to be here. I'm the player of the portal to hell. Don't allow these preachers to preach you right into hell. Come on, Robertson. Robertson, Jesus loves you so much, sir. But you know what? You're going to have to give an account to God. Because how can you love God who you love? How can you hate me? How? How? But that's okay because you know what the Bible says? That you are, uh, are dressed nicely. Nicely, right? But you're still a hypocrite. You're still a Pharisee. I didn't say that. The Bible said that. The Bible said that. The Bible said that. You know what? The Bible said that. That's okay. I'm not mad at you. I'm not mad at you, sir, because God still loves you. But you better repent or you're going to end up going to jail because the FBI didn't do their raids for nothing. Five churches raided. Five churches. Hundreds of millions of dollars. Huh? Then it took your VA money. Then it sold your money. Come on. Then it said about NCCC that NCCC was the so-called only organization. Come on. You have been living. That's what then it said about NCCC. We have been living under a blanket of fear for years. That if a man or woman operated outside of NCCC, that he or she will be damned to hell. Change that NCCC to HOPCC. We have been living under a blanket of fear. You guys have been living under a blanket of fear. That if a man or woman operated outside of HOPCC, that he or she will be damned to hell. Come on, people. I didn't make this thing up. That was Dennis's letter to NCCC. I didn't make this up. He said, this, however, is not true because no single organization can effectively evangelize the entire population of the earth in sufficient time. That is unreasonable. That's the same thing that Dennis has you thinking that House of Prayer is the only church. Oh, no, if anything, it's not the church. House of Prayer is a portal to hell. House of Prayer is a portal to hell. You know what? Barbara said, it's easy to love God, right? It's easy to love somebody that, like, that loves you back. Come on, Samuel. Samuel, you know la verdad, Samuel. Yo no sé por qué tú estás aquí, Samuel. Tú sabes la verdad. Tú sabes la verdad. Nosotros te queremos. Nosotros estamos aquí por ti si tú necesitas algo. Pero tú sabes la verdad. Esa gente, ¿no? cuando te fuiste, ¿eh? ¿qué hicieron? ¿Ah? ¿eh? Yo, yo sé lo que hicieron, porque yo, yo sé lo que está pasando ahí adentro. O sea, yo te garantizo que ellos ni te querían hablar. Yo te lo garantizo. Ese es el amor de Dios, Samuel. Ese es el amor de Dios. Dios dice que tú tienes que tener amor por mí. ¿Cómo es que tú amas a Dios, pero tú odias a tu enemigo? ¿Cómo es que tú odias a tu hermano? Yo soy tu enemigo porque te digo la verdad. No, yo no soy tu enemigo porque te digo la verdad. Come on, Robertson. It's easy to love somebody that loves you back. But God goes further than that. God, Jesus said with the, with, with the sinners, with the murderers, with the child molesters, huh? It's easy to love somebody to love you back. But are you supposed to love me and I'm not your enemy? Where's your, if you say you're a Christian, where's your love of God towards me when you see me out in the street, in the store? Where's your love of God? You know why you can't show no love to me? Because you don't have it. You can't show anything that you don't have. If you don't have the love of God in your heart, how can you show it to me? Huh? Huh? Actually, you can love all you want, honey. You said your husband said he was gay and that he slept with Christy Bundy. <laughs> and you still sitting there. What about Veronica Heisman? What about Christy Bundy? Veronica Heisman, what about Veronica Heisman? Huh? 
They sit in there in adulterous floor in an adulterous church, ma'am. An adulterous church. Huh? All of you. All of you sit in there. Christy Blasey, she married somebody younger than her son. Veronica Huntsman, huh? That's adultery. God calls that adultery. But you know what you do? You put your hands over your eyes and you don't want to see it because it's not dealing with you. But when it, when it comes your time, oh, Dennis has your number, honey. Dennis has your number. Dennis belittles you, huh? Belittles you, talk bad about you, condemn you, and you're still here? Come on, Gabe Rodriguez. When are you gonna leave? You were gonna leave before, Gabe. When are you gonna leave, sir? When are you gonna make a stand for God? You're preaching these people straight to hell, sir. You are preaching these people straight to hell. The Tasha Prayer is a portal to hell. But God, but God. Come on, Pamela Robertson. Why is it that you can't talk to your mom, Pamela? You're wore out too, honey, I can tell. You are wore out. You are ready to get up out of there. Make a stand. Make a stand. Make a stand. God loves you. You can come out. You're not going to be gay. You're not going to be a homosexual. If anything, that's Dennis. Dennis is gay. Dennis is a homosexual. I never heard about bestiality until I came to this church. You know why? Because Dennis is of the devil. Dennis is of Satan. Okay? There's no turning back for him. Dennis blasphemed the Holy Ghost. There's no turning back for him. But there, there's still time for you. There's still time for you to repent. There is still time for you to repent. Dennis can't take you to heaven. Dennis cannot do miracles. Robertson, didn't he call the other day and say, oh, 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 oh Robertson, uh, I haven't done a miracle in, in signs and wonders in a long time. I, I can't do one right now. Lord, tell me one miracle. Tell me what miracle Dennis has done in this church. What miracle? Oh, honey, I get all the recordings all the time, honey. I, I am well aware of what's going on in there. Well aware. You was there, Breen. He said that he could make a miracle, that he hasn't done miracles in Santa Wonders in a long time. <laughs> when? When has Dennis done a miracle? When? Tell me. When has Dennis done a miracle? That's a lie. He's a false prophet. The Bible tells you, beware of false prophets, because you know why? He's gonna, they're going to deceive the very elect. Come on, and that's you guys. But we love you, and God loves you, and God will continue as long as God uses me, because I'm nobody. I don't claim to be nobody. The Bible calls me but dumb. But if God wants to use me as a vessel to tell you guys that God loves you and that there is still time, I will be here no matter what because God loves you. Where's my son? CJ, where are you? CJ, where are you? I haven't spoken to you in years. Brother Romo, Brother Romo, come on, Brother Romo. When are you going to make a stand for God, Brother Romo? When are you going to get your wife and your baby out of there, Brother Romo? Don't preach these people to hell. Brother Romo, all that yelling, in God, in God, come on now, that's not God, come on. A soft, still voice, the power of the Holy Ghost is still real. The power of the Holy Ghost is there. God is there to deliver you, to deliver you and to bless you mightily. The Marcos left. The Bushes left. They woke up. Bernie left. He woke up. God has blessed them mightily with two children. Come on. While well, Christy Bernie is sitting in this church living in a basement. But her husband never wanted to divorce her. Christy Bernie or Christy Bob. And Veronica. Veronica Heisman, because she's not a boss. Veronica Heisman. Sitting here. In adultery. Come on. Jahira, you said that you love New Testament because of so-called the corruption. But what about uh so what about Christy Brady? What about Veronica Heisman? It's adultery, man. You're late, you're staying, you're you're visiting an adulterous church. It's a cult. Come on, brother, brother Prince. You know the truth. Don't preach these people to hell. 
Don't preach these people to hell. Don't preach them to hell. Is that Jenkins in that black? Jenkins, God loves you. God loves you, sir. You committed adultery, sir. You committed adultery. Kia never wanted to divorce you. You are living in adultery, sir. God will never, never bless that marriage. God will never bless Veronica's marriage. God will never bless Christy Brady's, uh, Christy Bone's marriage because you guys were living in adultery. You are living in adultery. Allie, come on. All you have to do is come over here and show your grandbaby to uh, your baby to his to their granddad. Come on. He loves you. He loves you, Allie. He loves you. That's that God. How can you say you love God, but you reject your own family? How? How? How in the world you say you love God, but you reject your own family? Where is that in the Bible at? Come on, Herd. Herd, we know you. You have no shame. You have no faith, sir, whatsoever, but I love you. I love you. All I know is to tell you that he's not going to talk to you. Then why do you carry a Bible? You say that he'll talk to the people about you. That's a lie. My God talks to me through his word, through the Bible, through the word of God. I don't pray to be anybody. But you know what? I'm here to tell you that God loves you. God loves you. TJ, where are you? TJ, I know you're here. I know you're not getting a love in the fire. That's why you're here. You know why you're not getting a love in the fire? Because it's demonic activity. It's demonic, it's a demon. 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 It's a
Come on, Christy. Wake up, Christy. Wake up. You're married to a man that's younger than your son. Your husband never wanted to divorce you. Come on, fall two. Fall two, you said you were gonna leave. Don't let Mary hold you back. Bradeen lost his wife, but you know why? He gained more than that. He made a stand for God. And he gained more than that. He gained a beautiful wife, two children, and still has a relationship with God. Come on, Fosu. Fosu, are you gonna leave, Fosu? Fosu, how much the more are you gonna be there? God, help! Ah, God, help, Lord! Come on, God! Come on! You're a good beginning! Come on! condemnation. You did this and you did that and you're this and you're that. Come on, how much the more? God loves you. God doesn't condemn you like that. But if you turn a, a deaf ear and a blind eye, you know, Jesus fights for his people. Jesus fights for his people. Come on, Darius Cooper. Jesus loves you. You're still young, sir. You can make it out. You can make it out if you want. Oh, worn out. Keep you busy. Monday through Friday, prayer meeting, Bible study, Bible college. This, that. Come on, uh, Shmeka. Shmeka! Didn't you say that the rapture was going to take place today, Shmeka? Ha! Shmeka! You said the rapture was going to take place! Shmeka! You said that even if you went to hell, you would still love house of prayer. You are going to give an account to God, sir. God still loves you. You are going to give an account to God. You said that even if you went to hell, you would still choose House of Prayer. Really? Did House of Prayer save you? Did Dennis save you? Who saved you? God or Dennis? Come on, Smoker, don't 
acima do rol, e eu fui que não tem rol, mas a praia é da porra do rol, tá tudo que acima do rol. Vira lá pra mim passar, 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 The, the the that red car was in the way so come on walmart you don't have to be gay walmart anymore you don't have to be gay walmart walmart aren't you tired aren't you tired of standing there confessing to stuff that you didn't do and then as we record you so he can hold it over your head aren't you tired walmart man God, there's so much freedom there's so much love out of this place and God, there's so much love in God. Come on, Ramo. You can make it out of there, sir. You can leave. Ramo, God loves you. You can make it out of there if you want. You don't have to be gay, Ramo. You don't have to be gay, Ramo, sir. Come on, Alex Price. Don't let them marry you. I know you're about to get married to that girl in Fayetteville. If an arranged marriage, sir, you should be able to pick who you want and who you like. You shouldn't be forced to be married, sir. Come on, I know you're getting married. Or you probably got married already. But come on. You don't want a, a, an arranged marriage. You should be able to pick your spouse. You shouldn't be allowing a man to pick your to pick your spouse, sir. Jesus loves you. A man that leaves Jesus loves you. But you have to marry. You have to give an account to God. We love you. Come on, Sister Hurd. Sister Hurd, you're tired. You're worn out, lady. You are worn out. But God gives you, God loves you so much, Brianna. God loves you so much, honey. He loves you, he loves you. And you're in a cold. You don't see it, you're in a cold. What about you, Irene? Huh? When are you gonna go see your mother, man? Your dad was real sick. When are you going to go see your mother? Huh? Come on, Adrian. Adrian, remember what you said to Diana? Be careful not to worship man. You remember that, Adrian? You remember that? I know you do because God, God brings it to your remembrance. You told Diana, be, be careful not to worship man. And what are you doing, sir? You are worshiping man. You are sitting in a church where they're committing adultery. It's an adulterous church. Veronica Heisman is in adultery. Christy Brady, she's in adultery. Christy Barnes, so she's not Brady no more. Adultery. And you sit there and cover your eyes, turn a blind eye and a deaf ear to these things that God has brought to your attention. Come on, Robertson. You think the FBI raided six churches so they can find nothing? Huh? You stole the money, Dennis stole the money, and you allow Dennis, you worship Dennis. What about worshiping God, Robertson? God still loves you. God loves you so much, sir. But you know what? You're preaching these people to hell. You are preaching these people straight to hell, sir. Straight to hell. 
And you will give an account, sir. You will give an account. You will give an account because you know what? You can wear all the nice robes. You can wear the finest, the white shirt and tie. But you know what God calls you? A Pharisee. But you know what? Jesus came for me. Jesus came for me. Not for you, not for the Pharisees. Jesus came for me. Jesus died with the sinner. Not for the religious hypocrites. Jesus died with the sinner. Not the religious hypocrites. I don't need nothing from you, sir. How about it? That's okay. I don't need... Oh, no. I don't want nothing from the, the devil's hands. I don't want nothing that's coming from the devil, sir. No, thank you. Right? Well, sir, you know I'm telling you the truth. You can't come to me. No, I got water, sir. I don't need it. I don't want nothing that comes from Satan. I don't want anything... I don't know anything. I don't want anything that comes from Satan, sir. Nothing. Record it. Don't take it. I don't want anything that comes from Satan, sir. Jesus loves you, Bible said. I know, but Jesus, it's hotter in hell, sir. It's hotter in hell. If you don't repent, you are going to hell, sir. If you don't repent, it's hotter in hell. If you don't repent, you are going to hell, sir. For worshiping a man. Didn't Dennis call you the other day? Robertson, Robertson. Uh uh. Didn't I do? I haven't done signs and wonders in a long time, but I can't do one right now. From where? Show me where Dennis uh, made a, 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 a miracle. Show me. Show me where Dennis made a miracle. Where? It's hot out here, but hell is hotter, sir. Hell is hotter. Because if you don't repent, you are going straight to hell, sir, because you are preaching these people straight to hell. How to pray is a portal to hell, a portal. So you need to repent. You need to repent. Repent. You can laugh all you want, Sabala. You are preaching the people straight to hell. What position did he give you? Um, how much money did he give you to be a preacher? How much money did he give you? What about you, Sister Irene? When are you going to go see your mom and your dad? Yeah, you you waving that Bible, but are you reading it? Because Dennis says he's not going to talk to me. Dennis says God doesn't talk to you, that he talks to the preachers about you. That's a straight up lie. Because my Bible speaks to me. <laughs> my Bible speaks to me.
No, you still got it, honey. You just still under a fake name. Jesus still loves you, sir. Jesus still loves you. Jesus still loves you. We love you guys still.